Hey, what's up? So I thought I'd do a little update video about the website. Uh, I'll probably do these whenever there's enough to talk about. So uh, yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff that's happened to the website, a little bit of controversy and things. So let's get into it. So first of all, let's do the updates. Uh, probably one of the most requested updates was for the Park or Spot map. Uh, people wanted to be able to add photos to the spots, so you can now do that. Uh, literally, there'll be a little block at the bottom that says upload a photo. Just choose a photo and upload it to the spots. So another big feature that people wanted was uh, forums and message boards. Uh, it's actually quite a clever idea, I didn't really think of that. But uh, basically people wanted a place where they can have their own little communities on there. So if you were coming to say London or you were going to Beijing or something and you wanted to find some people to train with or spots to train, uh, you could literally just go on there and message people. And yeah, I honestly think that's a really good idea. So I'm going to try and find a way of doing that. I've already come up with the first version of it. I haven't put it live yet, but that is something that is definitely going to come in the future. So that's definitely going to be on the website and you can be sure to look forward to that feature in the coming months, I guess. So probably one of the bigger things that happened on the website uh, is a little bit of controversy about the uh, park or spot map. So I went on Facebook on the Facebook page and uh, I put, you know, it's really cool to see people posting all the park or spots around the world and stuff and all these different places. Uh, and then one of the subscribers came on and said, you know, have you seen Scott Bass's warnings about these things? Uh, Scott Bass is one of the creative director of Angry Sam, which is actually my favorite YouTube channel. Um, and they kind of got me into parkour and free running. And Scott Bass came on to the Facebook page and kind of joined in the chat. Um, and he was saying, you know, the idea of parkour spot maps is a really good idea, but the kind of actual implementation of them uh, is usually ends up being really bad. Because um, say you have like a parkour spot and it's a really local one, but maybe the security guards don't really like you too much and you found a way of sort of making a deal with them that you can go certain hours and certain times and stuff um, and that's fine for them. But now you put it on the spot after that on the parkour spot map and now a bunch of people come along who don't know about this and then now you've lost the spot because they go at the wrong times and do the wrong things. So artsy. So if everything that Scott Bass has said pretty much agree with because I mean it is a big problem that I didn't actually think about on the website um, and it does need to be addressed. But he was kind of saying that we should take it down and I feel like that's kind of the easy approach to do. Um, but I'm definitely taking what he said into consideration and we're going to be implementing a whole bunch of different things to try and fix the problem. Uh, so a couple of things that we're going to be adding is uh, extra fields that you have to fill in. So for like specific details like security and things, there will be a field for security and what times is it good to go there, what's around there, what's the best way to go there, is there any problems that we should know about, that sort of thing. And you'll have to fill those out because, yeah, it's a good idea and we're going to be implementing that sort of thing. If you guys have any other suggestions of how we should tackle this, um, I've been through a couple of different ideas, and then please do put them in the comment sections below or hit me up on Facebook or something uh, and suggest them and maybe they'll be implemented. Who knows? Wait, pan. That's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> so to summarise, it's really cool that people are using this website way more than I thought people would. Uh, there's been tons of activity on there. So, uh, you, so you can now add photos to the Parkour Spot maps. Uh, we're going to be kind of changing the way that you can add Parkour Spots on there to kind of try, try help out with problems. Uh, if you have any suggestions of things you want to add to it, uh, and sort of features you'd like on there um, and also as I've got this really cool community going and you know the whole website is about community and stuff if anyone out there has any sort of uh, website development skills i.e. coding knows how to make websites that sort of stuff uh, and wants to help out with the project then hit me up on Instagram, Facebook or YouTube comments or something or private message me on YouTube um, I can't pay you <laughs> obviously but if you want to help out the project and be part of it, then yeah, hit me up. Because I need people to help me code the website and new features for it and stuff. Because I'm not the best coder in the world. But yeah, thank you for watching and keep using the website. And keep adding powerful spots and that sort of stuff. Bye!